art. It helps make life worth living as talented people share their gifts. And that was going on in Aiken today. Loving art was easy. It was in the bag. Out there somewhere with George Escala. For art lovers, a chance for this to be their lucky day. And we are gifting original art to the Aiken community. When you say gifting, what does that mean? It's free. <laughs> Inside these bags are 80 works of art from dozens of artists associated with Art and Soul of Aiken, heading out of the studio and onto the streets to be discovered. Kind of works like a scavenger hunt. We um, hide art all over town. You're giving yeah. it away here. Uh, yes. Did, I, did you? This is like the worst of your work. What are you no, giving? No, 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 no. It's 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 just fun stuff that you know we do. Volunteers with the bags in hand fanned out across Aiken, hiding them in businesses. There were weather worries. The bags creating a lot of buzz. What is in here? <gasps> are you serious? Can I really have this? Yes. Oh my gosh! The bags had tags basically saying, find it, it's yours. And the tags ask that you post on our social media, let us know you found that art and what you think. 12-year-old Scott Maldonado scored. Really beautiful. All right. Painting of a butterfly. What is it? A uh, painting of a butterfly. Mm, mom's birthday, you're done. <laughs> It may be better than ice cream, free art on a steamy July day in Aiken. Yeah, art is cool. <laughs> and free to those who found it. Out there somewhere in Aiken, George Escala, WJBF, News Channel 6. I wish I had been walking around Aiken today. Yes. So do I. What good stuff I would have to be found had. a bag. Beautiful pieces. Thanks for sharing your gift, artists. We appreciate it. And